Hi, I'm Daniel Overton from CR Kennedy, the Leica Geosystems distributors here in Australia. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to get your scan data from your scanner or your device from the field into your registration software on your computer. Now, one of the handy things to know about the scan data from the BLK360 is while all your data is stored on your mobile device, registered and ready to import, if by accident you lose your device on your way back to the office, all your data is still kept on the scanner, though it's not registered. To initiate the import process, first of all, we make sure that our mobile device and our computer are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. In this case, while not ideal, I'm going to be using my iPhone's hotspot. So, on my mobile device, I've selected Daniel's iPhone. And on my computer, the same network again. We launch Register360. And at the same time, on our mobile device, open our app. Of the few different ways to import a project, this is how you bring in your registered project from Field360. On your app, you press the information button in the top right hand corner and select Sync Server. On your computer, select Create New Project. I've named my project Demo on both devices and you have a couple of options in the top left hand corner. For this process, I'm going to select Field360. Here I input the IP address and the port that's displayed on my mobile device. Then I select Test Connect, successfully connected. So we select Add to Project. This process is going to load a preview of all the projects on the mobile device. This is where I previously noted that you need to try and keep your Field360 app as empty as possible. The more projects, the longer this process will take. Now we've got a preview of whatever projects we have within our Field360 app. You can see I currently have two projects in here. Now again, another frequently asked question is, if I select import, it imports all the projects on my device. If I expand this bar, now I have these tick boxes viewable. If we untick the project that we don't want and leave the one we do, we will only be bringing in the one project. Now over on the right hand side, we have a number of different import options. Now again, I won't go through all of these. In this case, we didn't use any targets. Once we're happy, we click import. All right, now that our project has finished importing, we select OK, and we work through the ribbon across the top of the page. First of all, review and optimize. I'll optimize my bundle, and you have another number of different viewing options down the bottom here. We can either look at the bundle cloud or look at some slices. Now again, I'm not gonna go through all these different options. There's a number of different resources online to go into more detail on this. I'll then select finalize and accept and accept again. In this final report page, we have our option in the right hand side here called publish options. This gives you a list of different file formats you can export. Now register 360 BLK edition as standard enables all these options down the bottom here. And this includes RCP files for you to open up in any Autodesk software. So we select our desired file format, select our desired location, and hit save. Once we've chosen our desired file format to export, we finish by hitting publish. This will generate a report and the file extension that you require. Once successful, you can browse to the file location and open in your CAD software. So there you have it. This is how to use Cyclone Register 360 and the Field 360 app with your Leica BLK 360 laser scanner.